Hi everybody, happy Friday to you. So today I'm going to do my August favorites because it's September. So the year is literally flying by and I'm so excited because fall is right around the corner. Yay, pumpkin everything. Pumpkin lips, yes. So I have some favorites I want to share with you guys and there's some things that I just absolutely positively love, obviously, because they're my favorites. So let's get started. Boom. First thing, now my nails have literally been the same color for like two weeks now and like I cut them because they are growing out, but this nail polish has lasted for like two weeks. It's so phenomenal and I love the color. Look at it. Look at it. This is from Formula X from Sephora and it's the color called Oceanic and it's an oceanic blue. It's gorgeous. It's a cobalt blue and it has a pop of like brightness to it. So it's just so pretty and super duper long lasting. Like I'm super impressed with how long this has lasted on my nails and not chipped off and flaked off and peeled off because usually nail polish peels off my nails. It's weird. But this has it and it's a gorgeous color. So even though this has been on for two weeks and it's, you know, not the most freshly painted manicure, <laughs> It still looks good and you know from afar it's like oh up close you're like oh that's a pretty color but your nails look like crap but ah. <laughs> so I really like this nail polish it's really long-lasting and looks really good doesn't chip doesn't fade or doesn't peel and it's gorgeous I mean hello look at that blue you know you love it all right next thing is what's on my lips right now this lipstick gives me life guys this is one of Kat Von D's new studded kiss lipsticks in the color called Chula I have it on now. It is so gorgeous. It is like the perfect pumpkin color for fall. It's like a burnt pumpkin orange with slight hints of red. It's super wearable. It's warm. It's rich. It's delicious looking on the lips. It like, I want to go eat some pumpkin pie now, but it's so good. Oh, this is going to be on my lips all fall. I just know it. So if you're looking for a fall color and don't necessarily love like the dark vampy lips, this is like a great option for you. I feel like the formula is really nice. I've, I have heard claims of her lipsticks being drying, um, but this one is creamy and rich and smooth and I don't, I don't feel like it hydrates the lips by any means, but I don't feel like it dries it out anymore. And I've had this on for a little while. I still have like some move and slip to the lips. Like I don't rub my lips and my lips are like... You know, like, it still has a creaminess to the lips. I love this. And this color, <laughs> it gives me life. Seriously, guys, I love this and 110% recommend it. So if you're looking for a nice burnt orange red color, like a really nice rich fall color, this is it. You need it. I love it, so pretty. All right, I know I've already touched about this in one of my Friday favorites, I think, but I, this is my favorite foundation. This is the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. I am in the color Warm Nude, I have it on today. I feel like it just makes your skin look gorgeous. Flawless, but like skin. It just makes you look like you have really nice, healthy, radiant, glowing, but not oily skin. Like, I am combination skin. And I feel like it does good on my dry areas, on my oily areas. It's just perfection. I love it. I'm so happy I got this. Like this, yes, yes, <laughs> love. <laughs> A couple drugstore items that I've been loving. This first one I used in my last Get Ready With Me video. This is a blush from Jordana. It's super affordable, like $2. And it's beautiful. Like this rivals some of my high-end blushes. When I put it on, I get the same feeling I get when I put on like my more expensive blushes because it adds such a warmth and glow to the cheeks and it looks like it looks like it's um like an expensive blush product. I mean, look at look at this cheek. Tell me it doesn't look fabulous. I know, it looks fabulous, right? <laughs> Not to be conceited, but come on, look at that blush color. Oh, love it. I should tell you the name of the color. That would probably be helpful for you guys. This is in the color called Coral Sandy Beach. Ah, oh, love it. It's a beautiful coral color. It has a little bit of a gold sheen to it. And it's super like powdery and smooth and pigmented. Hello, hello. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> it's so pretty. Oh, it just gives such a beautiful warmth and glow to the cheeks. Love, love this blush. Pick it up promise it's fabulous and for two dollars yes yes <laughs> a another drugstore cheek product I've never had any luck finding a good highlighter from the drugstore until now this 
This is so pretty. What are you called? It's the Physician's Formula um, Shimmer Strips All-in-One Custom Palette for Face and Eyes. I mean, you could totally use this for your eyes because it's super pigmented. But I love this. This is what the colors look like. And I usually just mix it all around. You could use just like the lighter quadrant or the darker quadrant. Um, but we'll just do a dark and light. So you can see pigmented and then swirled all together is that gorgeous kind of opal color. I love this. This is so pigmented and gorgeous and has such a beautiful sheen. I have it on today as my highlight and I feel like it's just gorgeous. And so if you're looking for a drugstore highlighting option, hello, this is it. It's fabulous. It's so beautiful on the skin. It doesn't look chalky or fake or powdery or overly shimmery. It's just kind of a glow, like a very healthy glow from within, like what highlighters should be. So I've been loving this. All right, and last but not least, my favorite eye palette of the month has been the Anastasia World Traveler, what are you called? Shadow Couture World Traveler Palette. For $30, I feel like it's an excellent value for your money. You get 12 gorgeous eyeshadows, and I love them. I have them on today. Oh, they're so pretty, and there's such a great variety of different colors in here. You get your um, neutral colors, and you got some fun colors in here. A nice black, and these two like metallic shimmery colors. I mean, yes! Oh, it's so pretty. I love it so much. That pink champagne on the lids giving me life. I love it. So this palette has been a major hit this month, and I definitely suggest you guys check it out. If you see it in store, swatch it. It's just, it's fabulous. And 12 eyeshadows for $30, it's an excellent deal, and every shadow in here is awesome quality. Like, you get such great quality for the price. I love it so much. Alright guys, that was my August favorites. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave me a comment down below telling me your favorites of the month. Do you have any of the things I showed you? What are your thoughts and opinions? Anyways, thanks so much for watching. Heart you guys all. Bye everybody. Alright, you guys are going to have to let me know how the lighting looks. Like, I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying. My ceiling light is out and I just haven't, I haven't stood on a chair yet to change it. I wonder if I can get my husband to do that. Because I'm short. <laughs> like, because it just doesn't work out right, you know. Light, why did you have to go out? So it's a little bit darker. Oh, see, I feel like it's too dark. Oh, I wonder if I should get up there and change it or if I should just be lazy. Will you guys kill me if I'm lazy? Because I think I'm going to be lazy. <sighs> lazy, but I got a little bun in my hair. Because I got too much hair. I mean, seriously, who has this much hair? I do. I do. If I could just have half this, like, like the half that's down and be my full amount of hair, I'd be happy because I wouldn't have to spend forever a day doing my hair. But no, I have a crap ton, as you can see up here with my little bun. Oh, is it too dark in here? I just can't tell. <laughs> it might be too dark. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. Should I light a candle? I should. Hold. The old tober status. She lights a candle in the background because she's cool. I mean, really, I love candles. <laughs> but, you know, it does give like a nice little ambiance back there, right? You know, a little ah, something extra with all the glowing lights behind me. I don't know. I gotta finish this before the ice melts, you know, that's just like coffee water. Momento, por favor, when I finish my coffee. I don't speak Spanish. I don't even know if that's the correct way to say one minute, please. <laughs> Uno momento, por favor. I think so. I don't know. It's been a long time since high school Spanish. Like, over 10 years. 12 years? I've been out of high school 12 years? <laughs> Seriously? What happened? Where did the time go? I don't know. I'm gonna give myself a brain freeze trying to finish this. Because you know, like, this coffee at the bottom is, like, super cold. Because it's, like, with all the ice. I'm trying to drink it before it turns to coffee water. Ugh. Done. Yay! No brain freeze. <laughs> Just a little cold back in the throat, you know, but I feel like that's how brain freezes start. You feel it here and all of a sudden it's like, Aah! like that. That was like a pterodactyl. Aah! 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 And my dog's really, what the heck is she doing in there? I don't know, pups. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> One more time, just because it's fun. That was like half rooster, half pterodactyl. Gotta burp. I always have to burp when I film. That was impressive. <laughs> oh, well, that's fine. More ladylike to let out a little, little breath of air. I feel like a big one is just waiting. Like, you know, it's just sitting. Oh, the hiccup. Don't get the hiccups. I hate the hiccups. Do you guys hate the hiccups? I feel like the hiccups are physically painful. Like, I hiccup so like, like, like a pterodactyl. <laughs> I hiccup so hard that it hurts like my chest. Like it almost feels like little tiny 
crazy VTAC palpitations. Like, my heart hurts when I have the hiccups. <laughs> okay, at least let's get into the video, because you've already been rambling for like, what, five minutes? Five minutes! Hi everybody, happy Friday to you. So I'm going to do my... What month are we in? <laughs> Hi everybody, alright, so today I'm going to do, <laughs> why? Okay, we do this, do this right. Ooh, baby, 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 I'm cool like salt and pepper. <laughs> um, it's the physician, a little bit of physicians. <laughs> it's just physician. Why, why is it when I film, all of a sudden I forget how to speak, like, come on, Elise. It's the physician. Oh, fudge! I'm just not. I'm just not. It's the physician. Why, guys? Physicians. Okay, there we go. There we go. We got this. We do this. Let's do this. It's the physician. I don't know. Anyway, since the year is flying by at such an exponentially fast, exponentially fast rate. Wait, who am I? I don't know. So the year is flying by, and so I have some favorites. Duh, it's my favorite video. So, 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 hurry up, Elise. You gotta go pick up your child in a little bit and get your act together. Seriously, okay. Cheek, look at it, cheek. Look at it, look at it, look at it. 